So Vinod, here we are at KPMG's European Tax Conference. You are the Head of Tax Policy for KPMG Mayberg, our Dutch tax law firm. You were up on stage just now talking about the issue of substance in a post-BEPS world. Fascinating topic. Tell me your thoughts on this. What you see is that in the post-BEPS world, substance is evolving quickly. You see source countries scrutinizing intermediate holding companies. You see the European Court of Justice coming out with new jurisprudence on what substance means and the link with abusive tax arrangements. And on the other hand, you see the EU coming out with tax haven blacklisting and urging member states and third countries to introduce substance requirements for whatever type of income they generate. Hmm. So I guess the multilateral instrument is going to force a lot of people, in addition to all those things, to reevaluate their intermediate holding companies and similar structures, I guess. Exactly. The principal purpose test that is part of the multilateral instrument that will kick in in the years to come will be explained along the lines of what I think the European oh, Union has set forth. So just office space, qualified staff is not sufficient anymore. You need to have non-tax reasons to, uh, to substantiate a certain structure that you have. So I can imagine what that's going to mean over the next several years. Clients are just going to need to be looking at their structures, re-evaluating, is this fit for purpose in the new world? Exactly. And that's what we tell, that we tell our clients. It's business first, tax follows the business. It's a good thing to keep in mind. Business first, tax follows business. Well, Vinod, thank you very much for your time today. My pleasure.